What we have here, we're running at about one injection a second. You can see the explosion of the steam. The temperature, as you can see over here, is 390 degrees. It, as you'll notice from this, the heater's off, and the temperature fluctuates between 388, that's where the setting is on the controller, and 400. Uh, it'll start going up again. The heater comes on, it goes up. The, you can see the, the unit is fully insulated, uh, both with ceramic and with this aerogel to prevent uh, both conductive and radiative heat loss. But you can see the explosion. The water that, that comes out of here is uh, oxyhydrogen combustion that occurs inside this thing. Uh, of course, when water, when uh, oxygen and hydrogen combine, the result is water. And of course, you, you can hear the bang and the, the click of the bang. The click is the injector. The bang is the uh, the impact of the uh, water injection. And what is it, about 2.78 uh, ml per injection? It's 2.75. Yeah, it's point. And it's closing with the oxyhydrogen. Yeah. But it's interesting now. Yeah. Now, you can see the temperature now is starting to go back up again. Yeah, the controller goes up. And uh, temperature going goes up. up. So, I mean, what this indicates is there's, there's heat being released in here when this happens. And, of course, we're, we're releasing a lot of energy. There's a, a pressure relief valve in here that's set to 350 PSI. And uh, so the, uh, the steam that comes out, of course, is, uh, is releasing energy. You see now the temperature's going back up to 399, 400 degrees, and the heater is not on. Now, when we ran salt water through this, the explosion was much more profound. It was probably because we were creating more oxyhydrogen. It was like a shotgun blast. And, of course, we can't do that. We've, we've ruined the injector, but we will build another one of these units that, uh, that runs uh, the uh, salt water through it. For whatever reason, we get the more um, disassociation. We don't fully understand why, but at some point we will.